Good day, it's Rowena Liss from gettingittogether.ca and today I'd like to chat with you about what everybody ought to know about staying motivated. Wouldn't it be great if we were motivated 100% of the time? Oh, sign me up for that. But that's not realistic. There's going to be times when you feel a little bit of a slump or down in the dumps and that's when you want to call on a trusted friend or family member that's going to remind you of why it is you are doing what it is that you want to be doing. They might be encouraging you to reach a goal or to stretch a little bit further. And who knows, maybe you'll be one of those people that somebody calls on and says, hey, can you give me a little pep talk today? I'm just feeling a little bit down in the dumps. You wanna visualize what it is that you want to achieve, your end result. That will help in staying motivated. Also be very kind to yourself. There's no need with all of that destructive self-talk and using words like should and have to and you want to use empowering words like choose to and want to. Uh, also, set a timer. Sometimes, you know, it's easy to stay motivated when you've got a timer and you're working under the gun because as humans, it's only um, natural that we do leave things to the last moment and we work much better with that time pressure, that time crunch. It's so much easier to procrastinate when you've got all the time in the world, but when you have a time crunch, you need to stay motivated and get that job done. So try these tips along with several others. There's 10 of them all together. Just read them in the article below and let me know what one really resonates with you so that you're able to stay more motivated and get your goals of staying organized, downsizing, clearing out the clutter, or running a marathon, whatever it might be that is your desire to stay motivated, and leave it in the comment box below because I really look forward to hearing from each and every one of you. Have an awesome day.